Hello, we will be writing a simple program uh, to calculate the income tax for single uh, filing status for the year uh, 2018. Uh, many of you don't know how to write, uh, how your taxes work. So let me give an example here. If you scroll up, you have a tax bracket. This is published by the Uncle Sam. And uh, whenever you are earning, let's say, for example, uh, before we get there, let's go to the IRS table. Many of you or your friends or your dad uh, probably um, filing taxes. If they say their income is $20,000, $20,000, and usually it's filing status is single. If you see your filing status, single, single. And uh, so that means uh, if you are earning 20,000, you would be paying 20,213 $20, dollars, right? Let me uh, uh, make it a little bigger. If you see here, 2213, that's for single. If your income is between this range, all right? Um, we're not going to, they're just given this range, average range, so we should be okay. Don't worry about that. And uh, the, uh, all right, so don't worry about the range. We just calculate, the, the way we would calculate in this program is, um, if your uh, earning is, let's say 20,000, I give an example, first example. The way it works is the bracket. The, bra the way the bracket works is, for example, um, let's, where is my paint program? Here it is. If your income is somewhere around 20,000, right? 20,000 20, means you are in this bracket. Um, let me, uh, you are in this bracket, all right? You are between 9,525 to 38,700 bracket. So what does it mean, that bracket? That means your taxes is actually 10% uh, of 95 five plus you earned this 20,000 right this 20,000 you have somewhere here let me draw in red like red and so you pay this 12% the 12% let's say you are earning this 20,000 you are actually paying only 12% of this all right so when somebody says I'm in 12% tax bracket, they're not in 12% tax, tax bracket. They are in 10% and a little bit in 12% too. So the way now we calculate is 20,000 is earning minus 9525, 9525 times 12%, right? So that is your actual the the taxes are so let's go and calculate using a program i have a program here uh if you see here so let me dot a this is program i wrote so you, you say after twenty thousand, then you say your taxes is two two zero nine so uncle sam says two two one so four dollars different that's because we use the lower bound but Uncle Sam just probably averages this out. So, I mean, don't quote me here. Don't file your taxes like that. But you are okay if you if you pay, which is 2209, all right? But IRS says 2213. Uh, similarly, if your income is $56,000, okay? Let's go here. Let me erase all these guys. 50. Sorry about that. Oh dear, there's all this guy. All right. If your income is $56,000, then that means you are somewhere here, right? 56000 somewhere here. So how your taxes are calculated? That's calculated 10% of, oh sorry, 10% of 9525 plus 
of this this difference this difference you have to take which is 38700 minus 9525 right plus you need to take this delta there right that delta how much is that that is 22 percent of your income which is 56,000 minus 3870 so if you do that is your tax so if somebody says I'm in 22 percent tax bracket yeah but you're not really paying 22 percent you're paying 10 percent of first the 9,000 then 12 percent of the next probably 20,000 then you're paying a little bit and 22 percent so that is your taxes all right so let's go back and check uh, my program here so we say 56,000 right so your taxes is uh, see here the first tier you're paying so much second tier you're paying that much third tier so total is 80 to 59 so 80 to 59 if you scroll down oops oops sorry oh, stop stop 56,000, 56,000, 56,000 is 8265, you are paying 8259, that's because again I said it's a lower bound, right, we are always using the lower bound, all right, so that is how taxes are calculated, right, I'll give you one more example, 93,000, all right, let's go here, let's erase everything, You are pay uh, let me erase these guys. Uh, let me erase everything. That's easier. All right. So this takes time. Don't worry. We are done. So ninety-three thousand. What does it mean? Ninety-three thousand. That means you are somewhere here. You are in the tax bracket of twenty-four percent. But I said, like I said, you are everywhere, right? So 93% is 10% of 9,000, 12% of this difference you have, and 22% of this difference you have, and then the delta. So if you do all that, your calculations will be, let me put it again, 93,000. Our program is giving 16,609. Uncle Sam says, 93,000 if you come here, 93,000, we're almost there, 93,000, 93,000 is 16,616 and we are saying 16,09, so basically like I said, we are using the lower bound, uh, but the Uncle Sam averages out be on the range, okay, so don't worry about it. So that is how we are done. Your job is to calculate these taxes. Um, so just pretend we will give a number between this range and you have to go and figure out which tax bracket you are in and accordingly you uh, calculate the taxes, right? Let's say I've given again 90,000. So since 90,000 is here, you have to start you had, I don't know why it is not coming. You had to start working from 10% of this, 12% of this difference, 22% of this difference, then you need to do that. So it's a simple, uh, don't worry about it. Just simple if then else statements you need to use. You don't use rocket science, it's a simple if then else, right? And uh, so we will expand on this as we go, okay? So pay attention to this and get the job done. Thank you.